condition that is really um, harassing people all over the world, and that is COVID-19. Um, it's a particular condition that has affected many, either directly or indirectly. I'm sure on this call, everybody who is here knows a friend of a friend or a relative who has had a brush with COVID, um, some fatal, unfortunately, uh, but some have been able to recover. And today we just want to have a conversation and see uh, what is it that actually um, makes this condition such a, a tough one to deal with and how can it be sorted out? How can one be able to take care of himself or herself uh, so that you are able to <clears throat> live a healthier life? And if by any chance you are actually uh, infected of COVID, how can you be able to manage it so that it doesn't become fatal, you're able to recover from it? And more importantly, how can you protect yourself from this disease? Because it is good to protection is better than cure at any one time. And from what you have seen, people have actually um, incurred a lot of money uh, to, to get themselves cured after getting COVID. And uh, one doctor friend of mine was telling me the PPEs that they are using per day are costing people over 10,000 shillings in some of these uh, really posh uh, five-star hotel uh, and any hospitals. And you don't want that kind of expenditure. Um, and you don't want the trauma that comes with, uh, you can imagine uh, getting off work for 14 days, another 14 days to recuperate and, all, and, and the money expense. I mean, it's a very expensive condition to deal with. So today we decided just to have a conversation about it and um, see how can one be able to really protect themselves. That's where we are going to start. How can you protect yourself from COVID? Um, and live a healthier life. Um, as we all know, COVID will attack you. Uh, we are told to do the uh, to do the to do to do the um, to protect ourselves and to wear the mask, sanitize, and do all these things that are supposed to help you protect yourself from COVID. But we know that somewhere along the way. One, in spite of doing everything, one can get infected. Um, what can prevent you once you get infected? How can you ensure that you remain healthy even on the face of an infection? And especially as this COVID thing really spreads all over the place. And uh, one of the key things about COVID is that if your immunity is compromised, if you have a prevailing condition, um, then you're more affected than somebody who doesn't uh, have his immunity um, compromised. And it is important to check your immunity and see how can you ensure that your immunity is top, that you are able, your body is strong enough to withstand COVID when it, it just comes knocking on your door. And that's what you are going to start with. You are going to start with that kind of discussion. But before I start, I just want to introduce myself because I know there are some people on the call who may not know me. My name is Fred Gishuki. Fred Gishuki is an entrepreneur, um, is a businessman. And uh, Fred Gishuki um, initially was trained in the hotel business. I trained to become a hotel manager. And as I was looking for a job in that line, I found myself not as a manager, but as an operative. And uh, somewhere along the way, a stranger found me working in the hotel industry and offered me an op the opportunity of new life. He told me, Fred, there's something you can do part time, which can give you uh, some extra income. And more importantly, uh, can give you a platform where you can make a positive difference in people's lives. At that time, my, my dad was suffering from high blood pressure. My mom had, uh, sorry, my those conditions that really bothered them. And I came into Neo Life looking for money, but um, when I heard that there are products that can actually assist somebody to be healthier, I quickly used them as guinea pigs. Initially, they were a bit skeptical, but they ended up using the products. And um, within a few months, we were able to sort out both their issues, and that was very exciting. 
And that gave me a lot of confidence to not start talking to people about the products of Neolife and about the opportunity of Neolife. And the rest is history. Um, I've been able to make money out of Neolife. I've been able to assist many people with health challenges uh, through the Neolife products. Um, I've been able to enjoy a lifestyle. I've been able to travel um, to more than 20 destinations worldwide with Neolife. And what excites me about Neolife is number one, the products are excellent of Neolife. Number two, the opportunity of Neolife is wonderful. You get to make serious money. I always like sharing that the first check I got from Neolife was 300 shillings, but the highest check I've ever gotten is $13,000. So the money is good. And then the travel, you get a, a holiday every, every year, fully paid for uh, by Neolife. Um, I travel with my wife, I've been in America um, twice, I've been to Mexico, Mauritius, many places. And all this just because I've helped other people to either be healthier or to be wealthier. So if you have guests on this call, I know today it's about health, but it is important to just mention that there is money to be made in your life. Um, you know, for men especially, if you're broke, even if you're healthy, you still feel sick. Uh, uh, there's somebody who said on a light note that you can be so broke that you cannot pay attention. And that's the situation that we men are in. So there's money behind this. And uh, today, as we discuss about health and uh, how to sort out uh, health issues, um, also think on that line that maybe there's an opportunity here for you. I always say where there's uh, every cloud has a silver lining. The founder of Neolife, and uh, we're going to see him right now, joined Neolife because he had asthma. He used Neolife products, they worked for him, and he saw an opportunity and he got in. And today, the company is in 55 countries. So as we start, just keep that at the back of, my, of your mind. Um, as you're looking at my, my, my screen, you can see the mission of our company, Neolife, is to make the world a healthier and happier place. That's a mission of Neolife. And that is, um, I adopted that as my personal mission, to make sure that the world is a healthier and happier uh, place. And we are in this together. We are in this together. This is a team effort. Uh, we are here to change lives. Uh, even as we change our own lives. And um, when we get into the issue of health, because health is a, is a challenge and uh, chronic diseases have become something else. And as you know, COVID, COVID is, is actually targeting um, people with existing lifestyle conditions, but even people who have conditions which they don't know they have, um, COVID comes in and uh, lowers your immunity and the opportunistic condition just blows up. So uh, these conditions are deadly and they are conditions that must be uh, looked into, whether it's heart disease, cancer, lung disease, stroke, Alzheimer's, diabetes, uh, kidney disease. All these are conditions which come out and which are very deadly for us. And how do these conditions come out? It's good to just have that conversation. What causes these conditions so that uh, we know and we can be able to take the corrective measures? Um, the conditions basically come because of the diet that you're eating today. Our diet is not the best. And you find that, uh, sorry, uh, just a minute. Our diet has been a challenge for us because you find that we don't eat um, to, to, we really eat for pleasure rather than eating to, to, to meet the requirement according to WHO. Now, uh, just give me a minute here. Yeah? I want, uh, I think there's a bit of a challenge with my screen share. Just a minute. Give me a minute, I'm busy. Okay, so um, 
if you look at some of the challenges that we have um, as a result of diet, uh, they basically stem from the food that you are eating. You find that there's somebody who's saying that we tend to actually um, mess up our health uh, based on our diet. You find that the diet that we eat um, ends up giving us problems. And here we are talking about BMI, your body mass index. And we are looking at, um, is your BMI correct? And what is BMI? BMI basically shows you that whether you're overweight or underweight, and this is a clear indication of your eating habit because if you're eating the right foods, if you're checking your weight, then you're most likely going to have a good BMI. And you can see it there on the screen. Um, obesity starts at a BMI of between 30 to 39. To calculate it, just take your kilos, uh, the, the kilos that you have, and you divide it by your height, and you're able to look at your BMI. Or simply still go to town, and there's a guy there that usually does um, some weight measurements, and you just stand on a, on, a, on a weighing machine and it gives you your BMI. But BMI is very, very important. And your diet, this is where it's all at, yeah? Uh, and they say here, your diet can only be as good as the food that you buy. And um, this is a statement that just links what we are talking about, about the research that has been done that shows that when you boost your immunity, you can actually be able to ensure that you fight and you protect yourself from COVID-19. Um, and uh, it talks about the importance of vitamin C, uh, zinc, vitamin D, omega-3 um, in fighting or boosting your immunity, which in turn protects you from COVID-19. Um, <clears throat> but let's look at some of the challenges that we get that actually compromise our immunity. Because by the time you're getting COVID, if your immunity is okay, then you shouldn't actually become a victim. Um, like the statistics say over 95% of the people who get COVID recover 100% without hospitalization, but 5% might need hospitalization and the fatality is about one to 2%. So what causes that? And here are some of the challenges that actually um, come in. You see, the things that compromise your immunity there is bacteria, bacteria that you're exposed to on a day-to-day -day basis, viruses, molds, um, airborne allergies, agricultural chemicals, industrial chemicals, air, food, and water. These are some of the um, things that actually compromise uh, your immunity, pollution. These are very deadly things. Now, when you look at uh, the barriers or the defenses that we have, we have three levels of defenses. Um, these are the external uh, defenses, the, uh, the skin and the mucous mem membranes. Then we have the second line of defenses. Um, that's, we are talking about leukocytes and fungocyte, uh, uh, fungocytic uh, WBCs. These are some of the second line defenses. Then we look at now your immunity, which is your third line. This is a specific acquired immunity. Those are the lymphocytes and antibodies. These are the ones that come in because of the diet that you're taking. And these are there to protect you uh, from disease. But you find that especially the, the, the true immune system or the third line is compromised by the following conditions, which you can see right there. Number one, pollution. Uh, if you are in a polluted environment, definitely your immunity will be compromised. Um, nutritional deficiency, if you're not eating the right food, your immunity is compromised. Excessive use of drugs, which lowers your immunity. Poor diet, yeah, lack of proper rest. These are some of the challenges. Um, the high stress levels, heredity also plays a factor in it. So um, these are factors that are there, which we are all exposed exposed to and factors that actually compromise our immunity and make us susceptible to COVID and other lifestyle conditions. And that's just a picture showing you the immune system and some of the um, things that affect it. Now, let's quickly look at diet. Because as we have seen, diet plays a very key role in ensuring that immunity is strong enough uh, to withstand the attack of viruses um, out there. And how should you be eating? 
we go back to the food pyramid. It starts with the physical activity, daily physical activity, which is very, very important. Then we go to whole grains, um, which are very, very important, uh, which you should be eating on a daily basis. Then fruits and vegetables. Fruits and vegetables are actually, you're supposed to take nine different types of fruits and vegetables, different colored on a daily basis. Uh, many of us are not able to do that because of various reasons, um, money, uh, lack of focus, time, sometimes fruits are not in season. But you see, at the end of the day, your immunity is compromised when you're not taking enough fruits and vegetables. You're supposed to take very little in terms of proteins. Uh, in fact, they say you are supposed to take meat at least uh, three times a week. But the truth is we eat meat on a daily basis. And that gives us a lot of problems as far as um, our immunity is concerned. And again, meat by itself has a habit of building up cholesterol, especially red meat in your body. And when you have high cholesterol levels, uh, your immunity gets compromised. COVID takes advantage of that. Many of people today are actually passing on because of cholesterol um, and, uh, and, and pressure issues and, 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 and stroke. And when you look at this, they're actually related to too much proteins, too much meat in your diet. And last but not least, that is uh, fats and sugars, you're supposed to eat very, very little. That is the way we are supposed to be eating. But the truth is we eat the other way around. We've taken the pyramid and we have put it upside down we eat more meat than anything. We eat uh, very little in the way of fruits and vegetables. We don't exercise. We actually avoid uh, exercise unless we absolutely have to. And it becomes a big, big challenge. Now, that's a diet that is recommended by World Health Organization on the left. And that is the Western diet or the diet that you are eating today. You can see the difference. The difference is very clear. There's one diet that is helping you to get out of this world. There's one diet on the left that actually helps you to remain strong and to give, it gives your body the right immunity to fight disease. Now, what can you do in this kind of setup? And this is where we come in with a solution. The solution that we have came up through the scientific advisory board. These are board of scientists that actually did uh, the research on, uh, on, on people's lives. They discovered that people were getting a lot of lifestyle diseases and they were led by Dr. Arthur Fass, the gentleman you're seeing over there. And he's the man who invented oral chemotherapy. He said, why can't I develop products that will prevent people from falling sick in the first place? And that is how comes he made the scientific advisory board and they developed products that when you use, you're able to boost your body immunity and you're able to fight uh, disease. And one of our key products is called ProVitality Plus. ProVitality is a, is a combination of four very key items, trianine, uh, omega salmon, uh, minerals, and carotenoid. Carotenoid is an immunity booster. If you take it for 30 days, boost your immunity by more than 37%. So the first product that we recommend for you to fight COVID is Pro Vitality Plus. If you can get the whole pack, fantastic. If you can get the TNN by itself, the omega-3 by itself, the carotenoid by itself, or the vitamins by the multi by itself, they are available from Neolife. And they will still do the job for you in terms of turning the pyramid at the right side up and boosting your body immunity. Now let's look at specific products and benefits of each product. We start with Pro Vitality. We said it has trianine, it has carotenoid. Um, basically, it protects and optimizes your immunity. Um, it has omega salmon, which lowers inflammation in the body by 68%. So you actually uh, stay younger for longer. It also boosts your memory. Uh, we have multi with uh, essential minerals. Um, and you just take a sachet daily. That is Pro Vitality. And it has many, many benefits. Now let's look at the individual products. TreeNN. TreeNN enables your cells to absorb nutrients and waste to be excreted. Now, when you're taking TreeNN, you find that um, the toxins that ordinarily will accumulate in your cell do not accumulate. And you find that you're very, very energetic. And it improves uh, nutrient utilization in your body. And when you have healthy cells, then you are healthy. Disease starts when you start getting fatigued cells, tired cells, 
And when they mutate, you have several uh, sick cells, which actually causes disease. So the first product is pro-vitality. Uh, but now when you go to the individual product components of pro-vitality, one of them is TNN, which you are seeing on the screen. Uh, the next, and these are some of the key benefits. Energy promotes uh, utilization. I've talked about that. Um, and we go, we go on to phytodefense. Phytodefense helps in boosting your immunity. It's one of our products in your life. And when you use it in, 30, in about 20 days, it boosts your immunity by 37%. Usually we have an immunity of, of about 60%. So if you add 37%, you get to 97%. So you can see at 97%, you're able to hold cancer cells and they will never affect you or any kind of virus cannot affect you. And that is why we recommend a phytodefense or at the very least, you can use carotenoid complex um, to start with, yeah? So those are some of the benefits of, phyto, of phytodefense um, that are there. And they, it shows you uh, carotenoid complex uh, being the product that one of the products in phytodefense, um, if you take a bottle of carotenoid complex, it, it's equivalent to taking 115 kilos of fresh fruits and vegetables. And this is an amazing product. Let me tell you, it slows down the aging process um, by about uh, 44%. Uh, it's an amazing product. It's a product that you need to have in your house. It will help you avoid cancer um, and other uh, lifestyle conditions. Moving on, other products in ProVitality in the, uh, in the uh, phytodefense, we have Cruciferous Plus. Uh, Cruciferous is made from the fruits and vegetables that have a cross on them. That is broccoli, cabbages, the like. And it prevents you from getting hormonal cancers, but it also helps in boosting your overall body immunity. And it's part of the products that we recommend uh, for boosting the immunity. Uh, next is flavonoid complex. Flavonoid, again, it's made from fruits and vegetables. And uh, you're talking about your berries, your cherries, and the like. And this one uh, helps to lower inflammation in the body. And it is very rich in vitamin C. And we all know about the story about vitamin C and COVID and what it does for you. Next, uh, that is a product that actually combines carotenoid complex. Uh, it, it puts in there uh, flavonoid complex. Uh, it also includes their uh, cruciferous plus. We call it phytodefense. And it comes in terms of a sachet. You take a sachet daily and you're good to go. Now, moving on. We have a very exciting product here called garlic adm complex garlic is a natural antibiotic garlic will help to boost your body immunity uh, garlic is an antiviral it's an antifungal uh, it's antibacterial uh, it's a product that is just amazing it's not just made from garlic it's made from the pungent the smelly vegetables and we are talking about onions chives leeks um, and they harness the bioactive compounds um, the, the smelly part of it, and that is the one that is made to use to, to it's actually used to make our garlic alium. And the good thing is this, when you take it, it does not um, smell in your mouth. It goes to your small intestine, and that is where it ruptures, and it gives you the benefits that you're supposed to get in the small intestine. The other day, you were sharing with uh, one of the senior members of Neolife, and he was telling me that there's an, a very serious strain of COVID that is, has mutated and it is causing blood clots and, um, and, 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 a, and a cardiac arrest and a stroke. And some of very senior government officials in a neighboring country have actually experienced this. And garlic prevents you from getting blood clots, um, uh, even fib, um, varicose veins. In a, it stops you from getting varicose veins it enables your blood to flow smoothly. Um, it enables your heart to pump properly. So uh, it's a product that you really need to have around the house. It makes your blood thin so that your blood can be able to move um, in the body. And it's one of the key products that we need to recommend and use for ourselves to prevent ourselves from 
COVID. Now, another product that is important is called BetaGuard. BetaGuard is rich in vitamin C, and BetaGuard is a detoxifier. And when you use it, it removes toxins uh, from your body. And uh, by removing toxins, then it prevents you from falling sick. And it's a fantastic product. It's a product that is made from uh, fruit and vegetables. So these are some of the products that we are talking about that will actually help you in the battle against COVID-19. Another star product is zinc. Zinc is amazing. Zinc helps to boost your body immunity. Zinc will enable proper growth and development of your body. Uh, zinc will actually, uh, I've used this product. There's a client of ours who had a challenge with uh, uh, COVID and he was totally bedridden. And he was very skeptical from, uh, uh, from the word go. And um, the wife bought zinc and he only took one tablet a day for five days and he was back on his feet. That's how powerful zinc, zinc is. In fact, there's somebody who was telling me that zinc is the only product that dismantles um, viruses like COVID and the like. So this is a product that you need to have. I always make sure I have it in my house um, just for normal challenges that kids uh, usually get from time to time. And, but now in the case of COVID, you really need to have it in your house. In fact, if you don't hear anything else I hear, I say today, hear the word zinc, just hear the word zinc and make sure you get it. It will help you a lot in terms of ensuring that um, you keep COVID away uh, from your family and from your, from your loved ones. Now, um, Moving on there, let's look, let's look at what do we do? What do we need to do for our children? Because our children are there, we love them. They are back to school and uh, they're not really exercising a lot of social distance, unfortunately. No matter how the teacher screams and all these things, um, our, student, our children are there just having fun. You just need to walk into a, 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 a school and you find them at break time and you will see there is no social distance. Masks are just another story. And they are busy sharing lollipops and all these things. And what do we do for our children? Because they will go to school and they will get COVID and bring it to your house. And whether you like it or not, you become a victim. So what do you need to do? You need to protect yourself. How do you protect yourself? By getting them supplements that will boost their immunity, so that they don't become carriers or mosquitoes like they are called and they don't contract COVID and bring it to you in the house. These are the products that you need to get for your, for your children. The first one is omega-3 salmon mainly. We've talked about the benefits of omega-3 so I won't get into that. The second one is Vita Squares. Vita Squares is, a, is actually a multivitamin uh, supplement. It has minerals, it's a balanced diet in itself. Um, it's a similar to the tree and that we talked about that ensures the cells, their cells are functioning properly. There is VitaGuard, which is an immunity booster that actually helps uh, to boost the immunity for the kids. Then we have all C or chewable all C. Chewable all C is a vitamin C that we talk about. Vitamin C has been um, put across, and I, when I started, I mentioned it. It's a very important nutrient, nutrient in boosting your immunity and fighting respiratory allergies and respiratory problems. And that's why it is actually very good for COVID. And uh, we have a variety for kids, which we call uh, chewable all C. It's a sweet, it is very yummy, uh, but you also have a vitamin C for adults and it's a sustained release category. Uh, so that is it. Those are the products for your children that you need to get for them to protect them from COVID-19. Now. Um, and that is it. You can see the children there looking very, very excited uh, with the products. Now, moving on right there. In your life, you can become a distributor or you can get products from the person who has invited you. The choice is yours. You can either become a customer or you can get the product directly from uh, the person who has invited you or you can become a distributor and start changing people's lives one at a time, starting with your own. And that is the picture you're seeing there. We say we deliver to your door. And there's a business behind 
the whole thing. It would be so unfair for me to wind up without telling you that there is a business in your life. I joined for the money. I didn't join because um, I was unhealthy. I joined because I wanted to make money. But when I came in, I heard about the products and I remembered my mom had an issue, my dad had an issue, and we started with them and we were able to sort them out. So if you're here and you're a guest and you're looking at this business for the very first time, you are here, you want to learn more about our products. What I've given you is just a sneak preview of what we have. We have a lot of products that are there and which are all geared towards ensuring that you live a longer and healthier life. And uh, becoming a distributor is simple. This is something that you do online. You don't have to stop what you're doing and do in your life. You can do it in the evenings, in the weekends, in the public holiday. Right now, you uh, you just tick your phone like this and you're in business, yeah? But before I just wrap up this today's session, when we started, we talked about um, the issue of protecting yourself from COVID-19 and especially the new strain. We all know that the, the, the new symptoms are different uh, from the one that was there before, before people are used to having a cough, a cold, a headache, and that kind of thing. Right now, it has changed totally. Now you find that people, you get a rash, and that's a COVID-19 system. You get a problem with your eyes, conjunctivitis, that's a, 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 that's a, a symptom of COVID. Uh, you get a rash on your skin, that's a symptom for COVID. You get elevated cholesterol, suddenly your pressure goes high, that is COVID. You get um, some fatigue, that is, could be a sign of COVID. So the best thing to do, and this is something that I am operating on and which I advise everybody, is when you get fatigue, when you suddenly feel so tired, just assume you have COVID and take the right precautions and get some supplements and take the right nutrition, get some lemon, get some ginger, get some garlic, buy the fresh variety to start with, uh, crush it, make a drink, drink it. Um, and there's this thing again, uh, steaming, um, go there, take those things, crush them, boil them, uh, put some Vicks or put some Kaluma or whatever in that mixture, cover yourself with a towel, steam yourself, and you will be able to clear your lungs so that the mucus does not accumulate in your system. Uh, because that mucus accumulates and when it solidifies, you are gone, you know? And you take the, just assume the worst. You'd rather, it would rather not be COVID. Don't wait to go for a test because I've seen people who wait to go for a test. One of the guys waited to go for a test to be confirmed whether it was COVID or not. By the time he got the first symptom of COVID, his lungs were gone. He was on a respiratory, uh, on a respirator, because his lungs his lungs had been chewed up by COVID. If he had just listened to his body, and the fatigue came in, and shortness of breath, started taking care of himself, taking supplements, um, and changing his life his lifestyle, then maybe he may not have had to be hospitalized uh, in the hospital. Now, before I finish, I just want to invite uh, a lady. This is a lady that I respect very much. And she happens to be my relative. She's my sister. And uh, this lady is a nurse. Um, she's all the way in Germany. And um, I told her, since she's a medic, uh, it will be important for her to just weigh in on this matter and just share with us a little bit from now from a medical perspective. And she's also an avid user of uh, new life supplements. Uh, what should one do really um, when you start feeling nauseous and all these things? And how do you protect yourself? What changes do you need to make in your lifestyle uh, so that you can be able to uh, protect yourself from COVID? So Lucy, if you can hear me, um, maybe you can unmute yourself. Um, your video is off um, and just share a little bit uh, with people on uh, about COVID-19 and how we can really be able to uh, protect ourselves from COVID and what are some of the lifestyle changes that we need to make to actually uh, fight this condition. So Lucy, can you hear me? Lucy, are you there? I 
Okay, she seems to be having a challenge in uh, Okay, I think Lucy is experiencing some uh, challenges in uh, getting on board on this particular session. Maybe I can ask Gladys. Gladys, can you hear me? Oh, yes, Lucy is coming on board. Lucy, please unmute yourself. We cannot hear you. Lucy, please unmute yourself. Lucy, we cannot hear you. You are muted. Please unmute yourself. Just give me a minute. Hello. Hello. Lucy, you can go on. I think the co-host right is the one that was having a problem. Just go on. Oh, okay. Okay. My, my, name, my name is Lucy Gishuki. I'm an aspect professor. I am also a new life uh, director. Now, I wanted to add um, the session on about COVID. Now, from my own observation, uh, uh, my take is that uh, the challenge with COVID is that it's a lifestyle disease. And it being a lifestyle disease, whether you have it or you don't have it, you have to live as if you have it. You yourself, your relatives, and everyone around you should start changing their lifestyle. 
And one of the most important thing way of changing your lifestyle is taking plenty of water, also doing exercise, also helping in distressing, getting rid of stresses in your life because stresses are very uh, major challenge. Also in the area of steaming, don't wait to become sick. Steam, stay healthy, eat healthy food, do exercise, drink a lot of water and use supplements because like vitamin C is very good for preventing blood clots. If you're using vitamin C, even if it's a chewable form and prevents blood clots, even if uh, uh, COVID happens to pass near you, you see, it just be a minor respiratory infection. It would go there, there the, the way of the other people who are by now, they, they are having respirators and they even dying because of blood clots. Because when you have blood clots, it's very, very easy for them to go clog up your heart and you can even die very easy. That's why, that's why people with COVID are dying very, very fast. Also working on immunity. It being a lifestyle a condition, a lot of immunity me, my take is anything you eat that is not that is, does not come from the from the shamba, you should not eat. Meaning, you have to get the junk food, alcohol, cigarettes, all those things. Give them if you cannot get of them permanently. Postpone them for the time being because now there's a health challenge. Because there's no need of using a supplement here. We tell the friend you go down there and take three bottles of beer. Or you go down there, you take up maybe something that is not, you take a cup plate of chips that's not even healthy, that maybe has got a lot of chemicals when they're making it. So my feeling is it's time for us to think of living in a pure way and trying to sleep, to sleep adequately because also. When you have less sleep, immunity goes down. Try to sleep adequately and exercise. Exercise is very, very important. Like where I'm living right now, times I feel challenged. If any very old ladies, eh, these Germans, ah, wazungu, wazungu, ah, they do a lot of, they're always on the road running, even now in the cold. They're seriously running doing exercise. You look for my sister and my brother, who are my, my skin color, you can't even find one. You can always even see one once in a week. And I you now I ask myself, all of us are still living in the same environment. We're eating the same kind of diet. How comes these guys are living to 90 years and above and us even reaching 60 is a challenge? It's because of the lifestyle. Because we really need to change our lifestyle. With or without COVID, we need to change our lifestyle. Because especially exercise and drinking water and distressing is very, very, very important. Because that's how you boost immunity and prevent the conditions that are coming on the way. Also, uh, my feeling is you not use heredity or inheritance as an excuse that you, because people in your family have this, you also have to get it. Heredity uh, might give you a challenge because you inherit something from your parents, but your lifestyle puts the trigger. So when you have, maybe your family have diabetes, the fact that your mother, your father, your uncle had diabetes, I don't mean you have to have, but if you don't live a healthy lifestyle and exercise and do things you need to do to prevent getting diabetes, you'll get diabetes. But if you focus on healthy lifestyle, you'll get diabetes. So my take is we need to change our lifestyle drastically. Don't wait, start now, steam every day. You anything you need, you need to do, take that garlic, take that what? Start living and continue living in a healthy lifestyle for the rest of your life. Because you don't need to wait for COVID to give you a shake up for you to do. I know some of these things we're using that are harming our bodies are very expensive. We are, we are using our own money to point our, poison our systems. So my feeling is don't wait to get sick. Start something healthy and live healthy. As I said, teach your family, teach your relatives. It does not matter how much you can It does not matter how much you can do it. Like there's a place where I live here, where I live around where I am. There's another place I live down here. Where by the other day I was being educated, these ladies from, I don't know, from Chechnya or something, these yellow, yellow people, call them yellow, yellow guys. But I mean, hey, Lucy, you, you don't eat a broiler. You don't eat meat. Hey, how comes? And you have money. Me, I was asking them, what's wrong with you? You eat what you want to eat. You hardly cook what you cook because you have a common kitchen. We are living in the same place. You have a common kitchen, but people have cook in the same, same kitchen. So they always look at what I'm cooking. I said, what is this? What is this? They've never even seen 
vulgar, they've never said you can do cook beans. They are, they are, they cook carrots, they look at them as if they come from another universe. Because people are eating junk food. I know junk food is very, very bad for our bodies. So my feeling is eat healthy, say healthy lifestyle, exercise. Please just ignore the neighbors. And control because you know, your life is your own. Also educate your brother and your sister. Do the most important thing they need to do and your relative and your neighbor. Do the most important to, to live. Focus on becoming healthy. Not only because there's COVID, focus on becoming the good of tomorrow. At the same time, tell them as exercising, take this vitamin C, take this zinc, buy this omega-3 for your kids because they already make a positive difference in their life. Once you start from there, where they are, they'll see this person cares. So it is even be very, very easy for them to buy a pen for you from you because you show them that you care about their welfare. I don't know if there's any other question. And make it to be a day, daily, yeah. daily, like juicing with uh, this uh, tangawisi and there's tangawisi and there's, this is the one, it's called what? Turmeric. Ah, there's turmeric. There's turmeric. Me also there's use okra. Garlic, there's yes, garlic. Also use, I also oh, use okra. okra. Okra you can cut, put in water okay. overnight. Put one little water in okra. The more you just be drinking that very slim, it's very slimy, slimy. It's it if you can see that you can mix the mix. 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 You can mix the Always do this every day. Don't wait for anything to happen to you to start a healthy lifestyle. That's my take. Also take garlic. Garlic is very, very important. And be consistent in whatever you're doing. Before you even get one to buy the packet from Neolife, look for the, there's that garlic dough, you know, zongo na waindi apo ju, apo panaitu waje. This kairia ya waindi apo ju. Gara. Gara make tuko ju. There's that garlic for, Nini for in it on go dawa ya garlic. What is the white white in a tebete? The red one. The garlic, they are very small, small. These are very, very good. Buy that one, then also plan for buying the garlic from Neolife so that you don't stay with a gap without something that is helping your body. Because if we live, we live our body lives to charge, that's when you're, these things are hitting us across the way and you're getting challenges. So it's a time for changing your lifestyle. And being focused and focusing and continuing on that particular trend. Usame at the say you got the corona may control at in the medungu at the ah ah. medungu and the lena put in a maisha because you never know. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. They said, so Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Lucy, for that. Sorry, we had uh, uh, I lost network a little bit, but uh, I believe. You've been able to hear it um, about uh, some of the things that you need to take. And one thing about immunization, immunization is okay, it's good. But you see the challenge with COVID is that it's mutating. I, I heard the other day that uh, in Kenya alone, we have more than 50 different mutations of COVID. So if you are taking a vaccine, it's for which mutation? You see, at the end of the day, that's why they are saying, even if you take a vaccine, you still have to continue the precautions. So it still boils down back to you. Uh, how is your lifestyle? How are you living your life? Are you supplementing? Are you strengthening your body uh, to, to be ready the moment that you happen to meet COVID by mistake? So just like Lucy have said, uh, I think it's the, the onus is on our side to really uh, work on our lifestyle, uh, ensure that we take precautions before. Uh, don't wait until you fall sick because then it might be too late, but start now um, so that this thing does not take your weak point. Because the way I've seen the few friends that have lost, they, they, it sneaks on you and it looks, it finds you have cholesterol. It blows it up. It finds you have diabetes. Yeah. You didn't, you had not even tested for it in, uh, for diabetes. Nobody knew, you didn't know, you've been checking, you're okay. But somehow COVID just triggers it. And suddenly you have this fully blown diabetes. And if you're not careful, you're gone. So guys, um, let's, let's just take precautions so that we don't keep losing our loved ones and uh, we, we are able to live a longer and healthier life. Um, so uh, thank you so much, Lucy. I don't know that you have anything to add as we finish. 
Oh, uh, my feeling is uh, only the area of exercise. We really need to focus on that one. It's very, very important. Exercise is, is it boosts the immunity by, uh, by a very big percentage. Okay. In fact, uh, you just reminded me there is a doctor who was telling us that you need to do 10,000 steps every single day and yeah. COVID will not put you down. Yeah, and that everything. was to me very challenging because uh, I wasn't doing the 10,000 steps and I had to start doing them. So that's a challenge on our side. Are you doing 10,000 steps? Ca can you get a pedometer uh, on your phone? You can download an app which will actually monitor the number of steps that you take in a day. You'll be shocked. You'll find yourself doing 500 steps or less. And that's when you realize that you're in danger because your immunity is directly related to the amount of activity steps you are making. Uh, if you're making 10,000, your immunity is good. But if you anything less than that, then you're in trouble. So I think it's, it's, it's a life change, change that we all need to take. And uh, I hope and I pray that uh, for the guests who have come on this call, you have benefited, you have gotten something. For the distributors, you've also been able to get, especially distributors, my heart goes to distributors. Don't be a salesman. A salesman sells what he does not use. Um, don't be the guy who is selling Mercedes and taking a Matatu home. That is wrong. You should be your own best customer. So make sure you take these products. Don't just sell them. Don't just do it as a business. Use the products yourself so that you protect yourself from disease and you become a living testimony of what new life can do for you. Don't just focus on the business aspect only. Focus about your health and your life and your the life and the health of your family. And sometimes we, we debate with money and we say, oh, I don't have money. But you will pay rent on time. You will pay school fees. Even if the kid will be chased two, three times, you will still pay it. So if you can pay school fees, what is more important? Is it school fees or your health? If you, are, if you, are, if you stop working now, will you be able to pay that school fees? Uh, I mean, your health is more important even than that rent that you are paying. So because if you see, if you fall sick, you won't be able to pay the rent. It will be too late. So that is it on my side. Uh, it was great having you guys on board. Talk to the person who invited you. If you need the products, they'll get them for you. Uh, better still, uh, they will show you how you can partner with Neo Life, become a distributor, start buying these products at wholesale price, either for your own um, for your own health, for your family's health, or you can even do it as a business and build a global uh, opportunity in terms of neo life. Otherwise, thank you so much, guys, for coming on this call. Uh, Lucy, yes. Now, if Mary Jane is on the phone, I, she can talk. To, you can talk later after this call. Yes, I know she is. She had told me she would be on the call. Uh, so, Mary Jane, please talk to Lucy after this. Um, today we've kind of ran, run out of time. I think the presentation took a bit longer um, and we may not be able to take questions, but um, any questions that you have, get in touch with me, get in touch with your upline, uh, ask them, con let's continue with this conversation. Uh, next week we'll see which other topic we are going to cover, but um, this is a, we will not leave this topic. Uh, we will keep on... Detox. Detox. Fantastic. Uh, detox is a good, is a, by the way, that is a, a very good uh, choice because uh, if you have toxins in your body, that's where problems start. Yeah. Um, so that will be next week. But for tonight, I thank you all for coming on board. And uh, I believe um, you've gotten some value out of it. And this will be a beginning for us to take care of ourselves, take care of our families, and live a longer, healthier life. Thank you, everybody. Good night. God bless you. Um, and we'll be seeing you again uh, next week. And I know there are those who will be seeing more of, of each other in the course of the week. Uh, but for the other team, maybe we'll just be seeing you on Sunday next week. Thank you so much. God bless you all. And good night. Good night. John the Baptist.
Hallo.